on the most current program for International Student Assessment Exam, which in 2015 assessed millions of 15-year-old students in more than 70 countries, the U.S. education system performed approximately averagely compared to other high-income countries, trailing 14 other countries. While many American students perform on par with or better than students in nations with elite universities, these successes are only seen in a few states. Here are the 10 states with the best schools in USA. Massachusetts, according to the most recent rating of state public education systems that Ed Week has done, Massachusetts has the finest schools in the United States. Even states that are ranked well in education may not necessarily be at the front of the pack in all three of the areas that are examined, but Massachusetts is. These categories include odds of success, school financing, and achievements. For example, the average education level of a parent in Massachusetts is among the highest in the country and is often regarded as one of the most accurate predictors of a child's future success. The percentage of children in the state who have at least one parent with a bachelor's degree or above ranks fourth highest among all states. This percentage accounts for 63.4% of all children in the state, even while the state's expenditure of $14,000. $569 per student does not place it in the top 10 in the country. It is still much more than the national average of $12,526. Massachusetts K-12 students have the highest academic achievement of any state. Half of Massachusetts 4th and 8th graders are math competent. Only 39% of 4th graders and 32% of 8th graders in the U.S. are math competent. New Jersey one of the states in the nation with the greatest expenditures per student is New Jersey, along with a few other states in the region. The public education system in the state spends around $16,300 on each student, ranking it as the sixth most costly in the U.S. after adjusting for regional variations in the cost of living. It is the second highest proportion in the U.S., ranks second Vermont. That 4.8% of the state's total taxable resources are allocated to education. Although it is not always the case that increasing funding for public education would lead to better results in the state of New Jersey, the additional funding seems to have had a positive impact. According to the NAEP, 4th and 8th graders in the state are among the most competent in reading and mathematics. Furthermore, the state has the second highest proportion of 8th grade arithmetic advanced students at 16.3%. Vermont Spending $20,795 per student annually in Vermont represents the nation's highest level for any state. The state's public schools are ranked third best in the nation thanks in large part to the state's investment in public education, which helps pay for teachers' salaries, school supplies, and programs for pre-kindergarten and kindergarten students. Both the percentage of eligible pupils participating in pre-K programs 56.6% and kindergarten programs, 83%, are among the highest of any state in the U.S. New Hampshire The educational attainment of one's parents is one of the most reliable indicators of a child's future success. The largest percentage of any state's children who have at least one parent with a college degree is found in New Hampshire, where close to two-thirds of children do so, compared to around half of all children in the United States. A college degree is one of the most dependable roads to meaningful work and financial security, both of which assist families give resources to support the achievement of their children, who in turn help support the success of other family members. The percentage of children living in households with earnings that are at least twice the state's poverty line is the greatest in New Hampshire, at 77.3%, making it the state with the highest such percentage overall. Although the path that leads from resources to accomplishment is convoluted, having a secure financial situation might boost the probability of being successful in school. The poverty rate of New Hampshire is the lowest in the U.S., coming in at 7.3% of all the citizens. Connecticut Children's growth and development have been proved to benefit from preschool education, and Connecticut has the greatest percentage of kids enrolled in this helpful program. Preschool enrollment rates for children in the state between the ages of 3 and 4 are 65.6%, which is much higher than the 47.7% national average. With an 80.7% enrollment percentage in kindergarten, the state ranks third nationally among all the states. The excellent early childhood education programs offered by the state may be at least somewhat to blame for the success of its students in later years. For instance, 43.5% of 4th graders and 43.3% of 8th graders, respectively, in the state's public schools are reading proficient. This is much higher than the equivalent national figures of 34.8% 
and 32.7%, respectively, and ranks as the fourth largest proportion of any state. Additionally, this state's public schools had larger percentages of students who scored well on AP exams than all but two other states when compared to the student bodies of kids in 11th and 12th grades. Maryland Maryland's educational system is now ranked sixth best in the nation and first among states in the South. The state with the highest median income is Maryland, where the average household's yearly income is $78,945. Due to the state's substantial tax base, Maryland has comparatively high education spending. Approximately 3.7% of the state's total taxable income is set aside for education, which is more than the 3.3% national average. The state spends $13,075 annually per student, which is over $500 higher than the average. All classes in Maryland's public schools do well academically. The state has one of the highest advanced placement pass rates for 11th and 12th graders. 87.6% of state students graduate high school, compared to 84.1% nationally. Wyoming The only state wholly west of the Mississippi River with a top 10 public education system in the U.S. is Wyoming. Wyoming devotes a bigger than average portion of its budget to its public school system, despite the fact that there is some controversy regarding the relationship between educational achievements and school investment. Wyoming spends around 4.7% of its taxable income on education, which is the fourth highest percentage among states and more than the 3.3% average for all states. Every public school kid in the state benefits from more expenditure per child than the national average in part because of this. Pennsylvania The Northeast is home to several of the top public education systems, and Pennsylvania's is one of them. The majority of states with effective public education systems, including Pennsylvania, have well-funded public schools. In the state, 95% of public school pupils attend districts with higher per-pupil spending than average. Compared to children in the great majority of other states, public school pupils in the state have a higher likelihood of being able to read at the proper level. The state has reading proficiency rates for 4th graders of 41.2% and 8th graders of 39.1% both ranking sixth among all states. New York The issue of equity has long been present in the American educational system. Even while not all states have equally dispersed educational resources, some states go far further than others in their efforts to close the gap. One such state is New York, which is home to the biggest town in the country. The academic gap between eighth graders who live in poverty and their richer counterparts shrank the most across all states between 2003 and 2015. Preschool that is widely available and free to the public probably contributed to closing achievement inequalities. The third highest rate of all states, just over 58% of three and four years old children in New York are enrolled in preschool. These early education initiatives are in turn made possible by well-funded public school systems. New York has the third highest per pupil spending of any state at $18,665 per student annually. Minnesota. Academic success is frequently more likely for children reared by parents who are reasonably well-off and educated. The second highest percentage of any state is found in Minnesota, where 64.1% of children are being raised by at least one parent who has a college degree or higher. Additionally, one of the highest proportions of children in any state live in homes with earnings that are at least twice the poverty level. 69.4% of children in the state, public school kids in the state record close to national leading achievements in various metrics, in part because of this. For instance, only Massachusetts has a higher percentage of fourth graders who are competent in math 53.4% than any other state, and the same is true for eighth graders 47.8%.